already. Welcome back to Constant Complete Plays. Uh, the Bonnie of Isaac, we're doing some races again. Bonnie of Isaac, races. Uh, repentance. Yes, some races. Some repentance races. Uh, just like before, we're racing to the chest. We're all playing Isaac. We all have the D6. It's whoever gets there first wins. Now, there was a, there, it was kind of close the second time, I think, or the first time last we week. Dangerously close to being successful. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah. The, you know, it might it might get you know a little spicy this time. You don't know, but you know there might be actually a chance. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, whatever helps you sleep. <laughs> Matt laughs in his added twenty hours since last time we did this. Oh God, I mean I believe it. His knowledge only grows. It's true. <laughs> he I doesn't even need the item. Every day. He doesn't need the item descriptions anymore. It's already burned into his brain. I definitely knows. need them for the new stuff. Oh, well, then I guess you're really not that good at Isaac, then. Never mind. Yeah, yeah we definitely true. have a chance. <laughs> Three, two, one. Beep. Yeah. Oh, it's Let's go. Time goes almost perfectly. Wait, why is mine... Just pausing all the, all the time. What's happening? Oh, you're not clicked into the menu or into the game. Oh. Uh, you gotta click into the, the game. game. It's weird. It's technology and stuff, man. I don't know. Hmm. Lord of the Flies. Yeah, do you guys just constantly restart until you're like spawned by a treasure room? Yeah, I do. That's that's ah, the, the strat. That there or a curse go. room. Well, this is one hell of a fun. fucking warm up. Jesus Christ. Okay, I, I also get the Lord of the Fry, <laughs> the Lord of the Fries. God damn it, <laughs> Lord of the Fries. Let's go. Remember when uh, Freedom Fries was trying to be a thing? Yeah. Yep. Uh, Sadly, yeah. Sadly, I do. <laughs> you know, Lord of the Fries just naturally got me to thinking about that. <laughs> Who is the Lord of the Fries? Because it's it's not the French anymore. You know, they were knocked off their high horse for a few months, maybe. I mean, really? I'd... I mean, they were never the the. I'm just gonna restart this. This is terrible. They were never the Lord of the. Oh, of the fries. I mean, French fries are just fries cut in the French style. All right, they never owned fries. Let's get that straight right here, right fucking now. Okay. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh, I'm sorry. Please elaborate. That's all I have. Oh. <laughs> I don't even know what you said. But I said well, essentially, he's, he's declaring that the French did not invent uh, cut potatoes, um, from what I understand. Which I think that's a bold claim, but whatever. I think the French are perfectly capable of inventing cut potatoes. They invented the cut. Maybe. I, I actually have no fucking clue. I'm quickly, I gotcha. I'm quickly getting out of <laughs> If I ask like two or three okay. questions, I know how to me. get it out of you. I read that factoid somewhere once, and that's the limit of my knowledge. Okay. <laughs> All right. I don't know everything about French fries, okay? I'm sorry I ever made you think I, w I did. <laughs> Oh god. I gotta fight a little poop boy. Your mom's a little poop boy. My mom is not a little poop boy. She is a big poop girl and you leave her alone. <laughs> god damn it. She shits wherever she wants and then nobody can tell her different, damn it. <laughs> you guys gotta run yet? Um, I have uh like Fiery tears. Oh, fire! I mind. did have a run in, and then the, uh, it's the, the turn the, monster oh, killed me. Oh, the uh, the chili pepper one. Ooh. Oh, that's good. Okay. Yeah, like she's like a little blue candle every once in a while. All right, fighting the Duke. The Duke of the fries. Not this. That's again. the Resident Evil Duke. <laughs> Oh, that 
was easy. And I got the torn photo. Yeah, I got a pretty nice start. I got stigmata. Stigmata. Or, nice. or not stigmata, of the, the crown of thorns. I, I don't know that one as well, so. Cool. <laughs> that sounds like uh, a thing. You know, it's like the thorny crown that Jesus wore. Right, 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 right. It's yeah, like I, I get the visual. I just, oh, it's just damage up. Okay. I mean, hell, any damage up in this is like awesome. They feel so, like, rare. I mean, well, everything's I mean, rare. They're a lot more common items. now. God damn it! I keep walking into the blasts. Is telekinesis? That's a that's a space bar item, right? Yeah. All right. Yeah, I'm not taking that. Well, baby's not seem to do a whole lot here. Which one? Boiled baby. Boiled baby. That just sounds like a, like a delicacy. Old... It just the randomly one... shoots stuff. Like randomly shoots tear patterns. Uh, I think it shoots more if you're closer to the people. Oh, is that the, the trick? Okay. Oh, sweet. Mama's pills. Here's hoping none of them kill me. All right, tears up. Good, good, good. I would stop there. Another tears up. Let's go. I'm not stopping. Well, I mean, you Health can take down. the same pill. Well, it was it was still unidentified for some reason. Mm, that's weird. Experimental pill. Speed up. Tears down. Okay, I think I. I think I'm back to square one with the tears. And now I have increased my movement speed by 0.15. I think that's after four. Oh, and I lost a heart after four pills. There we go. So the jury's still out if that was worth it at all. Maybe a little bit. I don't know. Nope, not even a tiny bit. Just a little bit, you know, just a tiny, just a tiny bit. <laughs> nah, Let me have this, man. Come on. Pills completely. They're so bad now. Yeah, they were bad before. Up. Now they're worse. And it's 100% against pills now. You know, we've been trying to get you off pills for years, and I'm just glad that now, finally, this is what is the camel, or the straw that breaks the camel's back. Yeah. Drug I joke! Took my, <laughs> I took my house cosplay too far. <laughs> it's lupus. It's not lupus. Damn it. What do I know? Give me more Vicodin. It was Vicodin, Vicodin, yeah. Man, I, I forget the hot the hot drugs in the times. There, there was quite a few. Hmm. Yeah, I had to uh, take Vicodin once for uh, wisdom teeth, and I took mm. one. Oh wow! And it might have been the best day of my life. So, <laughs> so it's all been downhill I, since. So then. I, I was like, I cannot take these anymore. <laughs> you have to. Know I yourself. like it too much. <laughs> yeah. No, like honestly, like to get a good example as to how good it made Matt feel, you have to understand it is the sole reason he enjoys uh, Star Trek: The Next Generation. Because he watched it first on Vicodin. <laughs> I don't think he would have ever wa ever watched it otherwise. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's fair. So that's the secret yeah. to you enjoying stuff. You just have to take Vicodin first. Okay. Yeah, I have to be I mean... pretty high, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, I took one. I was like, this is this is too good. This is great, <laughs> actually. <laughs> this pill's OP. So they gotta nerf this one. I, I can't remember if I ever took a Vicodin. I'm I taking think... hydrocodone, and that shit makes me extremely sick. Yeah, hydrocodone. Oh, yeah, that's good. I've, yeah, I've, I've had that I've... with mine, with my wisdom yeah, teeth. Yeah. 
I was about to say, I think that's the one I took with my wisdom teeth as well. My, f I should have gotten like a fucking anxiety pill because the second time I, I had to get them removed on both sides of my face. Uh, yeah, so the first time, you know, I had like an experienced dentist doing it. He just gave me the shots and then pulled it out and just kind of like it all, you know, a weird, gross feeling, but it wasn't like painful or weird. Second time, it was some new girl doing it, and like her hand was shaking the entire time she was doing the shot. It's oh <laughs> so like numb up my teeth, and then, and then like they were about to pull it, and she's like, "Oh wait, I forgot one more shot." <laughs> like, oh what? Oh, oh thank yeah. God. <laughs> They knocked me out for mine because I had I had all of them pulled at once. Ah, uh, well, must be nice. <laughs> oh yeah, it was amazing. I like like I didn't even know when I fell asleep. I just remember waking up. Yo, it's mm. it's crazy because they ask you some stupid ass questions. I've been put to sleep <laughs> twice, and uh, one was for wisdom teeth, and the other one was for some oral surgery I had to have. But they the dude's like, oh, we're gonna put on some music. Is there anything you want to listen to? Uh, it's if it fucking and matters. And then I was like, uh, I don't know, like, you know, whatever. And then, like, that's, like, literally the last thing I remember. I admit, the last thing I then, then I wake up and I'm getting fucking uh, wheelchaired out. Uh, <laughs> like, what the Put in the back of the car. And then the other time, they're like, all right, count down from 10. And I was like, 10, 8. And then I woke up being wheelchaired out. Like, it's like, damn it. How do you keep doing it? It's true. You guys are good. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to remember what it was. I, I remember telling them, oh, yeah, I work for an oxygen company. So, you know, blah, blah, blah or whatever. It was just a big conversation because they had one of those machines when they mm -hmm. under. And uh, I just remember, like, being like, you know, we were making jokes that I would help them out with it or some shit. And then I just, and then I woke up. You're just done. <laughs> You're just. Yeah. <laughs> it's crazy. I don't think I've ever been put under yet. Or if I have, it must have been like when I was a kid. I just don't remember it at all. But uh, I've been really drunk before and like I've woken up and time traveled. But yeah, I don't think that's necessarily the same thing. I, I don't think so. No. <laughs> I've never, uh, at least, at least I, I don't think I've ever been so drunk where I've like blacked out and not know where it was well you haven't lived man <laughs> yeah man haven't lived it's weird that i don't drink alcohol anymore i don't understand why but anyways <laughs> you should totally get blackout drunk it's a lot of fun <laughs> no actually the reason i don't drink is not even like, like it, it tastes bad or anything it's just like it uh like, if, if I don't get to the point of, like, the perfect line of drunkenness where you're, like, between buzz and, like, actually drunk, drunk or whatever, uh, I am I just get depressed and tired. I just, <laughs> it's just like a party pooper. So, me drinking beer is actually not beneficial to anybody, especially mm. me. Yeah. So, it's just like, yeah, well, what's the fucking point? <laughs> like, I'll try beer if it, like, tastes good or something or, like, you know. Oh, this flavor has like cranberries or some shit. You should try it out. I'm like, okay, yeah, sure. I'll try out something, but I don't like actively seek alcohol anymore. Me neither. We all just party too hard. It makes me sick for like a week. I get like yeah. hung over for a week. Mm hmm. Like, oh my God. It didn't matter what Matt's age. I mean, we were like, you know, right out the gate. Oh, we can drink. And everyone's like, oh, yeah, when you get older, it gets harder and whatever. And Matt, Matt like, just started that way. <laughs> yeah. Matt was just born old. It's true. <laughs> That's the way I like it. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Is there anything worse than finding an item after um, it's no longer useful? Like, 
finding the golden key after you've already opened the doors? Um, yeah. Taxes are it? pretty bad. Yeah, taxes, <laughs> getting blackout drunk. Oh, yeah. right, right, yeah. Malaria. AIDS. Okay, Ebola, yeah, I get it. I'm talking about in this game, not in, like, all of life. Okay, life's oh. pretty shitty. I get it, but, like... Well, um, AIDS. Oh, fuck it. <laughs> That's not in the game. As far as you know, you just haven't unlocked the item yet. I uh, no. <laughs> how do you know not? How do you know AIDS not is not in the game? How do you not know? How do you not? How, how do you not? not? Game? <laughs> <laughs> how do you not know? Don't not no shit. Leave me alone. I get it. I said a word wrong. Okay. I'm not as sick as you drunk as I am. Yeah. You're drunk right now. <laughs> N nuh uh. I can't be drunk. I just told you how depressed I get when I drink. What? What are you? What are you talking about? What are you Anyways, talking? Not, now it's time to play this really happy game of Isaac. Mm, yes. <laughs> As I fight the devil. <laughs> well, not the devil. It's the. Yeah, it might as well be the devil. Falling. It, it's the guy that comes out of the holes. I, I don't, oh, I don't know. little I, horn. Oh, little yeah, horn. That guy. I, Not to be I confused. Like little, foot. little foot. Mm, totally Can we talk different. about how bad Land Before Time is? Dude, the first movie's awesome. No, it's not. They're all incredibly boring and terrible. Well, well man, like if you want to go on a 13 movie spanning franchise or whatever, please. Really, go like off, they go lost. Off, King. They lost all of, like their charm after the first two. They never had yeah. charm. They were always bad. Yeah, but like at the time, I feel like there had to been like something to them. I mean, it's not you know. I mean, they had <laughs> enough to make like thirteen movies. You know. Well, okay. Now, like two, like theater movies, two or three theater movies, and like ten straight to DVD yeah. slash VHS movies. Just because you can make a lot of the movie doesn't mean they're good. <laughs> I'm just saying, there's enough of a fan base to, you know, they made money. I mean, off of it there's somehow. like fourteen, yeah. you know, Friday the Thirteenths. Not all of them are good. good. All, like one. All great. <laughs> it's true. That, yeah, yeah, it's true. Not all of them are bangers. Most of them are flops. <laughs> yeah. There was a weird dinosaur craze back in the 90s. I don't know what... Uh, Maybe, like, archaeology was just... Well, yeah. I guess... I, I just couldn't tell if, like, Jurassic Park came first or, if like, something inspired Jurassic Park. Like, I don't know if there's, like, a bunch of, like, archaeological, di archaeological digs and are like, oh, shit, T-Rexes were huge. And now they're like, ah, oh, shit, T-Rex has had feathers. And everybody's like, nah, that's not, that can't be right. <laughs> that's can not my T-Rex. Yeah, can you edit that part out? Can you? <laughs> can we rewrite history? Thank you. Also, I'll have you know, uh, fuck, joke about creationists and then them riding dinosaurs. <laughs> Nailed it. Yeah. Oh, that was the joke. Okay, I thought. Okay, never mind. Yeah, no, you did it. Good job. Hell yeah. Woo. <laughs> Hell yeah. I'm number one. Oh, I hate this. I hate, I died. I died to the frail. The irony. He's a tricky one. Why would I? But he's frail. Him? How can it be so hard to beat? <laughs> oh God. All right, I'm going to try to make do with a little frame. Blue. Oh, Jesus. Liu Kang? No, my my pug. <laughs> that passed away a couple years ago. Just with the oh. eyes popping out all the time and peeing everywhere, you know. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Dude, I feel bad for pugs. They're bred to do that. And then they have yeah. a bunch of problems because of it. It's mm -hmm. fucked. Oh yeah, no, it's uh, some dog breeds are just literally <laughs> bred to die. Well, not bred to die, but like that they're kind of like genetically uh, 
predisposed to yeah their cuteness kind of... is 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 their suffering exactly let's say they got rough bulldogs aren't too far off because of their short snouts and shit too yeah uh i think it's uh i don't remember what what dog it is now there was one where i saw the difference between oh god I, I, it's gonna kill me not knowing what it is uh it's it's the one with the weird flat face but it's like short hair um it's like an angled like really flat nose wide oh my god what the fuck is that dog dude it's gonna bother me but i saw like the difference between it like now and it like 100 years ago and it's just like it's crazy mm. to see how how dogs like straight up like are just slowly over time just are are looking much more i don't know uh, curated for people's wants yeah well i mean i think that's fine but like not when it comes you to know the... not not when it's weird and then they they're all they have a rap sheet of yeah <laughs> it's a rap sheet of genetic ab abnormations yeah this dog shouldn't even like technically be alive but hey here we are yeah and also the people are like yeah i want that dog have you seen that dog hmm. <laughs> Did you actually look at the dog? Because uh, I'm going to let you know on a little secret. It's not cute. <laughs> Some dogs grow on you, though, with their ugliness. You know, the, the, you, know you just kind of... It's like one of those dogs that have faces that only a mother could love or whatever. Right. I mean, I really like greyhounds. And I'm like the only... Do you? I think they're cute. I... See, I don't hate them, but I don't. Mind. I don't. I don't. I don't see the cuteness in them either. But I also have a a, a grotesque dog here, so it's like, what is my opinion, man? <laughs> oh shit! No. I think you yeah, actually. I think regular greyhounds are fine. It's just when people put them in uh, sweaters is what fucks me up. I think they look. Well, they get chilly, dude. Sweaters. They don't have a lot of. <laughs> don't <laughs> stick up for them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, clearly they did something wrong. Don't stick up for them, like. Don't, st don't stick up for them. I'm what roasting them. Don't stick up for them. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever seen uh, Italian greyhounds? Like, the do they just keep their paw? Like, they keep their paws like in a certain hand get gesture. And they <laughs> always are, they're. And they're always talking about the pe the pizza the pasta. Yeah. <laughs> no, they're like little mini uh uh like greyhounds. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like the proportions look a little bit more like because like greyhounds are so lanky and just big, you know? They're mm. not that they're not they're not big. Well yeah, they're not like huge huge or anything, but Yeah, they're like slightly bigger than like a I think they're like classified as medium, if I remember correctly. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think it's also probably just because of their um, what do you call it? Uh, because of how skinny they are or whatever that it, it like overemphasizes how, like, like how long they are. Yeah. That's fair. Actually, you know what's worse? Not even worse than a greyhound. A saluki. It's like a greyhound with like long hair. It's freaky. Oh, that's weird. The. I used to go to college where that was our mascot, and boy, howdy. It was hard to rally behind that one. <laughs> Although, my high school mascot was a duck, so I guess I don't really... I never really had a, a chance. <laughs> you know, my, uh, our high school was a bear, which was pretty dope, yeah. but my... Yeah, that's grade cool. Grade <laughs> 7 uh, mascot was a fucking gopher. <laughs> Well, you know, go for... Well, yeah. And then we were the Mustangs. Oh, we went through quite a lot. Quite a few changes there. Yeah, my my, my junior high was um, also a Mustang. Or like a bird of some type. A bird? Bird? <laughs> a bird? A uh, horse. <laughs> oh, no, it was the Colts. Oh, dumbass. Yeah, it's the Colts. <laughs> Yeah. 
Yeah, horse, whatever. Same thing. Everything's a Mustang if you try hard enough. I mean, yeah, they're just slightly smaller than the average horse. Of course, of course. All right, I'm going to take this pill because I don't give a fuck. All right, I got smaller. Could be worse. Well, I have holy brim. Holy brim? You motherfucker. I got regular brim. Oh, fuck. Well, regular little brim. Oh, little brim. I should probably get some hearts before I fight this guy. I got one heart that's just covered in poopy or something. I got, got a pro hearts. tip for you guys. Mm -hmm. You go for angel deals, which means if you skip the first devil deal, um... And go for angel deals and then you bomb the angel uh, mm -hmm. statue you get uh, the key piece but you can re-roll that key piece into an item that's how I got holy brim ah. so I had three items to choose from and was able to pick up two nope. two Some mega fatties oh my god very useful information. This would unfortunately make the assumption that I am getting devil deals, so. Don't take red heart damage on the second floor and then ignore it. Yeah. <laughs> this guy simple, says really. don't take damage. Like it's no well, you, big deal. You don't have to, you can take uh, soul hearts damage. You right, just can't yeah. take red heart damage. Dude, it, it, yeah, like, oh, like, yeah. Like, like I totally get that. It's just like, I just keep getting hit. <laughs> Uh, oh, like, I'm dead. I, yeah. All right, try again. Spectral tears, sure. Oh, what the fuck? Get guys, literally. So I had no idea. Oh, God. What about Mega Man? I'm his boss. He's called Mega Man. Oh shit. The Mega Man. I wonder if the magician works on Holy Brim. I know not. <laughs> and a black market? Okay. Never mind. Error room. I didn't Error. even know that was even possible. This guy's figuring out all new strats to kick her ass. Y'all been playing yeah, anything fun recently? Oh, uh, we played uh, Shimagami Tensei 3 this week. The re yeah. Re Is master. that the Nocturne? Oh, ah, okay. One with like the devil demon or whatever, or the, uh, the demi demi fucking fiend. Demi fiend. Demi fiend. That's right. Did you get Dante as your partner yet? I haven't got that for you yet. No, he's Damn not it. like a he's not a demon, he's like a actual character. Yeah. Where he's like, yo, this is fucked. And And the way Shimigami Tensei works is all your friends don't join your party, it's the demons that do. So Yeah. So you know, oh. he might be like a For cool. Reason, I thought he was... uh, yeah. I never play myself, so I, I I never really knew. I just I just remember fucking seeing the the book. The the magazine ads for it. <laughs> now featuring Dante from the Devil May Cry series. Wow. Oh, cool. Yeah. It, it looks I, like you find him at some point, but I, I don't know what he does after that. Yeah. I know nothing about, like, what his role is at all. I just know that he's in it, and they've teased him once. Hmm. He, he's going to hunt them devils, because he's, he's the 
He's, He's a devil hunter. hunter. He's, he makes he makes devils cry. Hence why they may cry. Hence the yes. name of the the series. Devil, the devil may cry. It may cry. It may not cry. <laughs> it may or mayn't. So I'm trying to respond. Ah! Oh God! These flies! Oh my God! They're not strong or anything, but they always freak me out because they're always like they have that erratic like. Oh, pattern. Oh, the motherfucking. The uh, yellow flies, the one yeah, that kind of like that shake. shake your your charge. Yeah, those guys. They're bitches. Yeah, I hate those guys. They're the worst. Eh, stop it. Stop it. Get away from me. Don't. Eh. So many bullies. So little time. Tell me you're Catholic without telling me you're Catholic. Uh, <laughs> oh, so many, so bulls. many bowls. Oh, okay, it took me a second. Like what? Mostly because I had to remember what I just said because I just kind of word vomit. So it's <laughs> just like, oh. all right. <laughs> Another cool thing after years of streaming and content creating, you just vomit words all the time. So when you said that, I was trying to go for like how left-handed people always got beat up joke, but uh, I couldn't think of one. <laughs> Evie's uh, grandpa was like one of the last, <laughs> was of that generation. He used to be a left-handed, and then uh, they beat yeah, it out. They of him. beat it out of him. Yeah. <laughs> yep. That's so fucked up, dude. Oh yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah, it was really fucked up. It still is fucked up. It's like, it, it seems like every time you discover, like, stupid shit that happened back in the day, there's, like, two new shits that are happening in current day, and like, what the fuck? What? Where'd all these shits come from? Turns out we were fucked up and are, still. <laughs> to this day. Yo, I, yo, I, it's, it's like I'm doing it on purpose. God fucking damn it, dude. I'm, like, trying to dodge and then running into, like, the other tier. It's, it, like... Yeah, you gotta avoid both. Yeah, I know. Don't worry, it's it's taken me some time too. Well, at least you got the stapler, so I have that. Leave me alone, Monstro. Get the fuck out of here, Monstro! I'll fucking kill you, Monstro! Stop it, Monstro! Don't do it, Monstro! I'm gonna kick your ass. Yeah. Oh, toothpicks, hell yeah. How do they... Oh, that's how they work. Oh. Ugh. I was like, how do they make my tears stronger? Oh, I see. Just keep your eyes open. With toothpicks. They blinded me with toothpicks. <laughs> with, with science? Fun. Toothpicks. Oh wait, oh shit. Yeah, yeah, no, give me that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, now I don't know what my heart status is. Oh god, now I can't take any hits. Oh jeez. That's how you do it. That's how you get a... That's how you become a better player. If you just don't know how much health you have and you just can't hit take any damage, then you're nope. just that much better. Just took one. Uh -oh. oh shit, you're fucked now, dude. Yeah, it's all downhill from here. Oh, All cool. Right. I got the, I'm on the wound. wizard pill. Ah, oh, shit. With full mapping. So what you're, what you're saying is you've won. 
I could die. I have full hearts and stuff right now, but I could. I could. There's a chance. Likely. Theoretically, I could die. In theory. <laughs> uh, you know, any chance is better than no chance, you know? I'll take it. God, that guy, guy like flew at me so fast. <laughs> that guy flies. Look a trinket that makes your tears like semi home. They turn at like a sharp ninety degree angle to hit things. And my holy brim looks real funny. <laughs> Goofy holy brim. Tricks are for kids or something. I don't know. Oh, God. What's your favorite Bad. cereal, Fizz Cake? My favorite cereal? Mm. Mm hmm. Mm. I think I'd have if if we if uh, non marshmallow cereals if we if we exclude marshmallow cereals you know because those are naturally superior in every way. And when it comes to basic bitch like puffs or whatever, Reese's Puffs was my shit. Oh, I but, love uh, if Reese's it, Puffs. Yeah, they're just really puffs good. Are like one of the few like things that like I, I can absolutely eat too much of, and it catches up to me way too fast, and I feel sick. Man. Like, we'll see. I, I've, but, uh, always, I've always literally been like, oh, yeah, Reese's Puffs so good. And then I'll have like an, like one bowl and be like, oh, I need some more Reese's Puffs. Let's keep the, the puff train going. And then I have that second bowl and I'm like, oh, fuck, this is not good. Abort. Why did I do this? This happened last okay. time and the time before that and the time before that. When will I ever learn? <laughs> Too much puffs. Damn it. Um, But if you're, if you're including marshmallows, then uh, probably like old tricks or like lucky charms was pretty good lucky but charms I, but... is is not good because they like they're good but like hmm. without the marshmallows their regular cereal is bad yeah no yeah that's yeah that's why you gotta have the marshmallows otherwise yeah it would just be bad <laughs> nowadays uh they got all kinds of crazy shit going on but uh yeah, I'm not Back up on the, on the current serial meta. I just noticed when I scan barcodes all day, I'm like, oh, well, that's fucking interesting. Oh, that's cool. Oh, what the fuck? I have oatmeal cream pie cereal, which is just Ooh. like literally like the it's, it has like no marshmallows or anything. I guess just the little oats themselves probably taste like the have the oatmeal cream pie taste on, in them somehow. I don't know. I don't know how they make it work through magic or science or whatever, but both, neither, probably, <laughs> all of the above. Wait, I think the the most top tier cereal is definitely yeah cinnamon I need toast. Your guys' crunch. opinion. Oh, that's a pretty good one too. Yeah, cinnamon toast crunch is pretty awesome. I I... Do, if you go to like those hotels that had like the multi mix, like you could like have like different. Uh, brands of cereal. Mm -hmm. uh, I would always try to get like Reese's Puff and Cinnamon Toast Crunch because that was the shit. Or Cinnamon Toast Crunch with like literally any other kind of cereal is fucking good. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, a, it's, it's, a, it's a good, combo good all around sure. cereal. You know, because mm -hmm. the milk becomes cinnamon. And it's like, fuck exactly. It. And you're like, this is, awesome. this is dope. There's not very many cereals where like the milk gets exponentially enhanced. Mm. The chocolate cereals are pretty good for that, but yeah, no. If without the chocolate, uh, cinnamon toast crunch is the best. Uh, like, I think I my favorite really... part about. Oh, go ahead. <laughs> Sorry, I keep uh, cutting you off about your favorite cereal. Go ahead. No, I, I was gonna say, like, uh, <laughs> growing up, it was either cinnamon toast crunch, uh, Lucky Charms, or Apple Jacks. I liked Apple Jacks a lot. Okay, yeah, Apple Jacks were pretty legit too. Yeah, Apple Jacks is another, I think it's a cinnamony type flavor, right? I think. If I remember correctly, yeah. It, yeah, it was it's like, like an apple cinnamon. 
I think for a while it was just Apple, and then like they had the cinnamon Jamaican stick or whatever that tagged along, and then now it's cinnamon too. You know, it, it was all kind. It was crazy. The nineties, they were a wild time for cereal. Yeah, I think I feel like that's when when cereal really came to its own. I keep pressing all the wrong buttons. God damn it! Okay, that's fine. Yeah, I'm literally almost dead fighting mom's leg right now. I was trying to blow up this donation box, and I literally used everything else except for a bomb. Nice. Well, you know, stop it. <laughs> Don't die. How's your How's your run going, Matt? You're Have you beaten him yet? No, I'm about to fight it, Liz. Mom's heart. Ah, shit. I gotta hurry. Where are you at, Fisker? I don't remember. I have had to restart like two or three times now, so. I think I'm on the third floor? Fourth floor? Where are those two? Oh, Christ. Get away from me. Ooh. Oh, Mega Man. I'm fine. Make oh, Mega Ma, not Mega Man. Is it Mega Ma? Uh -oh. Yeah, it's a W. <laughs> it's, 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 it's like I this guy Mega... looks nothing like Mega Man. So. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I never meant to make think I was actually fighting Mega Man. Well, you, why wouldn't you be if you were fighting? If you thought you were fighting Mega Man? I mean, there's other Johns out in the world, you know. <laughs> is it maybe. Is it, well, I don't think maybe, John is copyrighted by. I think John's copyrighted by Capcom. <laughs> I mean, come uh, what, on. what's the deal with Angel Room? Uh, take the deal, then kill the angel. Is that is that what you said? Yeah, yeah. save the cheerleader, save the world. Okay, so take the deal, kill the angel. Yeah, if you have a reroll, you can. Well, make sure you have a reroll so that you can reroll the key piece. Key piece is useless on this run. Yeah, I got a Bible. Uh, you can pick that up. For, um, uh, for getting closer to Bookworm. Got it. Which sometimes gives you a, a double shot. Oh, double shot. Oh, oh, oh. Also, if you didn't know. You can use the Bible on Mom, and it's an instant kill. Yeah. Oh. Well, that'll come in is, handy. Is it on Mom's fighter. foot or on Mom's, mom's foot. heart? But foot, foot, okay. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure. It I only works on Mom's foot. Yeah. I'm on floor three, four, five. Right behind Matt. <laughs> just, just, just right a few behind him. Hot on his heels. Oh, uh, you'll never see it coming. I do Get out of here, bone boys. Control. Oh, have you seen that uh knockout city or whatever? Yeah, the dodgeball Barunis. game. What you think oh, about yeah, it? Oh, yeah, yeah. It looks pretty interesting. Yeah. I play a little bit. Is it's it pretty fun. fun. Mm hmm. Yeah, it looks pretty fun. I don't know, there's like a lot of mechanics to it. I don't know half the tech, but... I don't know how they I... got it, but... um, And I don't know if you guys are, like, uh, uh aware of like uh Saikuno and like that whole side of Twitch or whatever. But uh yeah. they were able to a knockout city was able to get Saikuno, which is a guy who gets like sixty thousand viewers, like not not sixty like like twenty a lot of it viewers doesn't matter. all the time. Anyways, yeah. the point is they got him, Brie Larson, and then another streamer to play that game. It was like oh, a special wow. stream. Yeah. Like it's crazy. Yeah, they sponsored a bunch EA sponsored a bunch of people, including online. He has merch in the game. Mm. Oh, uh -huh. I didn't realize he had merch in the game. That's so cool. 
<laughs> yeah, it's like pretty shield cool. or whatever. Or his crest, crest shield, yeah. whatever. I don't know. I thought it was the bald thing at first. I'm like, man, I, I, I don't want a bald guy, but no, I saw the shield. It's like, oh, it's that thing, probably. That would make more sense. I don't think you can copyright baldness. I don't know. They you might be able to. Mega Man, they can copyright anything. Well, they can copyright. <laughs> okay, I don't think you understand the thing about Mega Man. I died. <laughs> God damn it. It's not John Mega Man. It's just Mega Man, the video <laughs> game. John Mega Man. Okay. Ah. Ah. Get away from me. Ah. Chance for exploding tears, don't mind if I do. Yo, me and Spencer started watching this weird anime. Actually, we watched two animes. One yeah. is oh. pretty good. Yeah. And it's samurai shit, which is yeah. not really... They're not even really samurai. They're like ronin. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, well, it was called? after the Edo period. Sh yeah, called Shigeru. Sh Shigerui. Um, Deadly Frenzy. I think it's the subtitle for that one, and it's, it's like, like it's like really well like like uh, like the the art is really cool and like interesting, and mm -hmm. it's very very adult. Um, and the so there's is, like a lot of a lot of booby in there. You know what I'm saying? Um, I mean, there's some yeah. tits, but it's mostly like grew to it as violence and like yeah, highly like, detailed gore, which is cool. Yeah, it was, it, that was pretty cool. Um. Oh, yeah, speaking of, did you hear... Well, I mean, you probably did. Berserk Sky? Yeah. yeah. Mira. Sucks. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Sure does. That also sucks. No. <laughs> <laughs> Not <laughs> no, as much as Guitar Mira passing, but... Yeah. A little bit. It's, it, it's a different... You know, there are different sucks in life. You know what I'm saying? There are different sucks in life. No, uh, good job. Good job. You did it. You know what's funny is right after making the joke about not seeing any any devil rooms, I got like like two in a row. <laughs> like like it it all of a sudden I just like found soul hearts and then stopped getting hit so much. <laughs> yeah, just get better at the game. Yeah, I'll just do that. Actually, just gets better at the game. Ah, shit. Yeah, marginally, you know, just enough. <laughs> now I look like the ass. Oh God! Yeah, but the other uh, the other anime. Well, wait, we're wait, wait, are we running it back? Absolutely, um, yeah, we got. Yeah, sure. Run back. <laughs> 